I'm David Kroll here for Texas Bar TV, the logo of which I'm covering up for the most part. I'm here with Mark Unger, San Antonio, and Rocky Deer of Dallas. Dallas excuse me. Uh, both very forward-thinking lawyers who uh, who worked on the adaptable lawyer track today. And I just want to get a quick take from each one of you about uh, what's the, what's the best takeaway you can you can give our our attorneys in a short moment here. Uh, wow, tough. Uh, there were so many great speakers, including Rocky. I always enjoy listening to him. Uh, I think that the takeaway that, that I'm going with is to stay engaged and to keep listening because what, what happens is it's like going to the movies for me. I forget how cool it is, how great it is to go to the movies and the, the enjoyment I get out of it and what I, what I pull uh, into my other life, which is the work life. And so just having the opportunity to listen to, to Rocky talk about the five Ps, for example, uh, it's like, it's like re-engaging myself in what my passion was when I started doing this, right. like 18 years ago. And, and there's just nothing like it. I mean, there's very few times that you get that chance to really have that level of engagement. So I appreciate that. It, it reinvigorated you. Yeah. yeah. You're awesome. How about you? <laughs> well, thanks, Mark. And, and far too kind. And, and for anybody who gets a chance, when, when the SBOT Ignite comes online, you need to watch Mark's talk about Moneyball. It was, I thought it was brilliant, and I'd never made that connection before, but, it, and it, there's actually, not only is it entertaining, there's actually a lot that you can learn in, in terms of the, managing the practice of your, of, of your law firm. What I think the takeaway is from Adaptable Lawyer, and I don't know if it's just this year, if it's every year we've done it, is that, is that number one, change is happening in, in the legal field. I mean, there's, there's no question. And it, that's just a market force that happens all the time. But it's not something scary. You know, I, even up until a couple of years ago, I used to think, oh my gosh, all this change, it's, it's frightening. I think it's an opportunity. And I think lawyers need to embrace the idea that change means growth. Change means opportunity. And it means, it means a chance to, to kind of get beyond what we do on a day-to-day -day basis, think in a different way. So I would recommend that lawyers read business books. I mean, go to the movies and make connections there and read business books. You don't have to just read John Grisham novels. You can read, <laughs> You know, some of these some of these things like Jim Collins is good to great, or what matters now, or you know, any number of these of these business books on marketing. They're all phenomenal. They'll get you thinking in a different way. So if you want to be adaptable, make sure you understand your environment and be open to open to suggestion and open to change. That's what I loved about the title, adaptable lawyer. It's it's a very hopeful approach. You know, it sounds, it doesn't sound like I'm stuck or I can't understand or I'm I'm not going to make it. No, it's adaptable. That's what it's about. I want to, I want to thank uh, Rocky and, and Mark for taking a moment here. I'm David Kroll for Texas Bar TV.